So today kind of got away on me after I started doing a little bit of videotaping for milking, but that's okay. Went to check the alfalfa and it looks like we're not going to silage this upcoming week, but next week my dad said it would be perfect technically to silage today, really, but we're going to wait, let it bloom out a bit more so that we can hopefully get a little bit more tonnage per acre. This does mean that it's a little bit less quality feed, but right now the position we're in, we're looking for quantity and not quality. And then I went to go check Harissa and she is looking like her ligaments are changing too, so babies are going to be coming soon for her. And then I wanted to answer a question that gets asked every so often and that's do you drink your own milk from the bulk tank? And the answer is yes. I take one of these ice cream pills full of milk home probably every two days. <laughs> ice cream pails don't continuously use this because eventually they're gonna pop out and you're gonna have a big fat mess on your hands so I always just carry it like this <laughs> So Harissa is in labor. She's early labor stages. She's showing the typical signs doing some pawing at the ground, digging around, getting up, laying down, and then getting up and laying down again. She's talking quite a bit, and I've just seen her start to develop a mucus plug, so we're getting close here. She lost her ligaments somewhere around 4 a.m. this morning, <laughs> so I've just been kind of waiting all day reason I know that is because I went to milk cows and I had to go and quickly check her so I'm hoping she'll have babies in the next one or two hours. She's starting to push a little bit but yeah <laughs> typical labor signs and her udder popped as well so we're getting there. And she's still chewing her cud through it for somehow, like... <laughs> I think this is her fourth or her fifth kidding. Because she's a five-year-old doe. And I bought her pregnant in beginning of April, so... I'm really excited to see what she has. Can look after. Oh, you gotta push him out first, Missy. <laughs> push 
finish the rest of the line. <laughs> so we got one boy there. She did a real good job. <laughs> and he's got blue eyes. Good job, Mama. He's a nice size, too. Wow. <laughs> you hardly made any noise. That's crazy. Oh, so he's a little chamise, just like his mama. Look at how cute he is. Another baby's on the way. Good job, Mama. Look at her go.
think she's done. That's one buck and one doe. So that was a really quick birth. I'm honestly, and like so underwhelming. Like it, it just, there was, she just did her thing. She wasn't noisy. Like that was such a relaxed birth. I can't believe it, but it's already done. So yeah, she's got one buckling and one doling. They're both blue eyed. I'm not sure yet if either of them are pulled because she's pulled. So I'm really hoping that one of them is. I'm not experienced enough to be able to tell right from the get go if they're pulled or not. So yeah, I'm really, really happy with how these two are looking. That little doling is absolutely gorgeous. Like she's so stinking cute. I'm like, oh man, I just figured out her name. <laughs> I was gonna say it's been my dream to have a little black and white goat and now let's try to figure out a name along the same theme for the buckling. I'd like something similar, kind of dreamy, kind of, you know, and I'll try to pick a name from one of the comments. So if you know a name that's kind of within that same theme, then comment down below. <laughs> so their navels have been clipped if it was necessary and both have been dipped in iodine just to disinfect their navels because it's technically an open wound, so if you can disinfect them, then that just helps them have a better setup for a healthy start. And I've seen them both drink, so they've both had colostrum, they both have an idea of how that works. So I'm gonna monitor them for a little bit longer yet, and then I'm gonna go home, because I also have to milk tomorrow morning, so. And you can bet money that I'm gonna be here extra early just to make sure that they're doing good. But I'm fairly confident. Good job, mama. He's so much bigger than her though. Like look at that size difference. So that's gonna be it for today's video guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I sure did. <laughs> and if you did, please like and subscribe and share it with a friend. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye.